Hello everyone. For patients with chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, physical inactivity is common compared with age match controls. Physical inactivity would lead to a decline in lungs function, increase the rate of hospital admission, and be associated with mortality, psychological functioning, and quality of life. So, physical activity is recommended as one of the core components of pulmonary rehabilitation. However, there is a lack of specific tool for effectively and quickly assessing the level of physical activity among patients with COPD and compared with objective measures. Questionnaires is more in expensive and more suitable for clinical use. The physical activity scale for the elderly was designed for elderly. It was divided into three components involving leisure time, household and work related activities which are relevant to patients with COPD. The PASE has been validated and shown to be reliable in several studies of elderly population and of patients with end-stage renal disease and knee pain. And the PASE has been translated into Chinese and is confirmed to have acceptable reliability and validity in Chinese elderly. So we selected Chinese version of PASE for elderly for our study. Our study shown that Chinese version of PASC has acceptable reliability and validity for patients aged 60 and over with COPD, and it can be used as an effective tool for measuring the physical activity of Chinese patients with COPD. In this study, the participants were 60 and over. In order to generalize the result of this study, all patients with COPD should be defined as people aged 65 and over. Otherwise, pedometers may underestimate or overestimate physical activity. Future studies should use golden standard measures of physical activity to improve the criterion validity. Thank you.